everyone, this is Shabnam here. Welcome back to my channel, The Counseling Corner. In this video, I am going to speak about insomnia. Are you finding it difficult to get sleep at night? Do you want to know what are the ways in which you can get good sound sleep naturally without taking medication? Then here are a few evidence-based tips for you. There are certain things which you have to do during the daytime so that you get good sleep during the night. First thing is that you need to do exercise regularly. You can do any form of exercise which you are comfortable with, be it yoga, aerobics, going for a brisk walk, swimming, jogging, anything. But ensure that you exhaust your body so that you, during the day so that you get good sleep during the night. The second thing is that you need to take care of your diet. You need to have your lunch, sorry, you need to have your dinner two hours before you go to bed and ensure you have a light dinner as well as avoid spicy and oily food because this will lead to indigestion and gastric problem and hinder your sleep. The third thing is that you need to keep a watch on your water consumption. You need to consume more water during the day time and consume less water during the night. Because if you consume more water during the night, you will have to visit the washroom often and that will disturb your sleep. The fourth point is that you need to avoid consuming anything which contains caffeine like coffee, tea or chocolate at least 7 to 8 hours before your bedtime. Research shows it takes 12 hours for the caffeine to get completely flushed out from your body. The fifth thing is that you need to avoid taking a nap during the daytime. People usually have the habit of taking a nap 15 to 20 minutes during the daytime so that they feel fresh after that. But if you are a person who find it difficult to get sleep during the nighttime, then you should avoid these naps. The sixth point is that you need to be very consistent and have a fixed schedule for sleeping. That is, you need to sleep the same time during the night and wake up the same time during the morning whether it is a weekday or weekends. But one day, suppose instead of sleeping at 11 o'clock, you go to bed at 2 a.m. Even then in the morning, if your time of waking up time is 6 o'clock, you should ensure that you're up by 6 o'clock. In order to get good sleep, you need to take care of your room environment. You need to ensure that your room is dark. Even a small light of a candle can disturb your sleep you can make use of thick curtains for your bedroom as well as ensure that your room is free from any sort of noise. Avoid any pets in your room because they will disturb your sleep as well as you need to take care of your room temperature. Ensure your room temperature is not very hot nor very cold but it is moderate. Research shows that the cool room temperature ensures that you get a good sleep. Next thing is that it is very, very important that you avoid exposing yourself to blue light because this will suppress your sleep hormone and prevent you from getting sleep. So you should avoid using any electronic gadgets, be it your mobile phone, your laptop, your TV, at least one or one and a half hour before you go to bed. It is very, very important that you reserve your bed or your bedroom only for sleep and go to bed only when you're feeling sleepy. Your mind should associate the bed to sleep. But most of us have the habit of doing everything in our bed. We sit and eat on our bed or we sit and watch TV as well as we work the laptop on our bed. This should be avoided. If you observe that you go to bed and 15 to 20 minutes you're feeling anxious, you're getting stressed out, restless and you're not getting sleep, you need to get out of the bed immediately, go to the next room, sit for some time and do something light, read something light or no, you can just listen to some soothing music and when you feel sleepy then you can get back to the bed. It is very, very important that your mind is very calm and relaxed. Only then you will be able to get good sleep. But if you're anxious about the next day or if you're worried or overthinking, then you will not get good sleep. For this, you need to do a few things to boost your emotional health. Always try thinking positive and before going to bed, 
practice positive affirmation practice writing a gratitude journal as well as you can write a uh, no sleeping uh, no sleep journal you can have wherein you can pour out all your feelings as well as you can write the plan for the next day because sometimes people are anxious thinking about the next day what they are going to do after that you can tell yourself tomorrow i will morning i look into it and i'm going to sleep calmly and then you can go to bed as well as you can do meditation and practice mindfulness to boost your emotional health research also shows that inhaling lavender oil also helps you to sleep well so you can take a few drops of lavender oil in a cotton and inhale and that will help you to have a good sleep so these are the few tips which you have to follow in case you want to sleep peacefully naturally without taking any medication but in case you observe after following these steps also you're not able to get good sleep and that is uh, taking a toll on your physical and mental health as well as affecting your performance the next day then it is a high time that you consult your physician and take his help sometimes medication would be prescribed hope this information was useful to you and in case it was useful to you please do give me a thumbs up do subscribe to my channel share my video with your friends and most important is hit the bell icon so that you get timely notification whenever i post my new video thank you so much